Good morning students. Now I am going to take 8th standard max chapter 1 rational numbers. You all know the natural numbers. The numbers series starting from 1 it is called the natural numbers. It is denoted as capital N. The number series starting from 0 it is called the whole numbers. It is denoted as capital W. Next, you know the integers. What is meant by integers? Integers means negative numbers, zero positive numbers. These are all called the integers. Integers is denoted as capital I or capital Z. Next, what is meant by rational number? Rational number means the collection of all the integers. The collection of all the integers, all the numbers that can be written in the form A by B. The collection of all numbers written by the form A by B, it is called a rational number. It is A is one rational number and B also one, one integers. B is not equal to zero. These two are integers. B not equal to zero. This is the definition of rational number. What is mean by rational number? The collection of all numbers that can be written in the form A by B is called a rational number where A and B are integers. B not equal to zero. That means denominator. This is numerator. Denominator should not B 0. Ok. Next. It is A by B. It is rational number. What is another name of that number? That number is fraction number. In small classes you have studied now. Fraction. What is fraction? One numerator and denominator. Up of the number is numerator. Down of the number is denominator. So the fraction 2 by 3. This is called a numerator. This is called a denominator. Okay. Next. There are many types of fraction. Now I am going to say the types of fraction. That is first one is proper. Second one is improper. What is third one? Mixed fraction and negative fraction. The proper fraction means numerator is less than the denominator. Numerator is less than the denominator. It is called a proper fraction. That means it is small. Numerator is small. It one is biggest. Okay. Next improper fraction. What is mean by improper fraction? Denominator numerator is greater than the denominator. What? Numerator is greater than the denominator. Numerator is biggest. Denominator is smallest. How to find the mixed fraction? Mixed fraction means one whole number. One whole number. One proper fraction. One whole number. One proper fraction. This is called a mixed fraction. Then another one negative. What does it mean by negative fraction? Negative fraction means numerator minus otherwise denominator minus otherwise whole number minus. These are all called the negative fractions. Okay. Are you clear? Next. How to find the equivalent fraction? Already you know that no. Now I give one fraction number. How to find the equivalent fraction. Now I am written 4 by 5. Find the 5 equivalent fraction of 4 by 5. So 4 by 5 is a proper fraction. How to find equivalent means numerator and denominator multiply with the same number. Numerator and denominator multiply with the same number. You get 4 into 2, 8. Divided by 5 into 2, 10. This is an equivalent fraction of 4 by 5. Okay. Now, what is the next another um, 
equivalent fraction 3 by 3 4 3 is are 12 5 3 is are 15 these is these are our equivalent fraction the equivalent fraction you get now you just simplify this you get this answer now see 8 by 10 okay how to simplify this these two numbers come in same table which table second table so divided by 2 by 2 you get 8 divided by 2 4 by 10 divided by 2 5 you get this answer are you clear simplification like that you all studied the addition subtraction multiplication division and all in fraction okay now how to draw the rational number in number line how to mark the rational number in number line first i will give the two mark the two in number line how to draw as usual draw one line two side arrow mark that is indicates no end center part is zero left side of the zero is negative right side of the zero is positive they are given plus two and minus two mark it plus two and minus two zero after one two three where is uh, plus two locate okay. so here one b plus two okay minus two minus one minus two minus three where is minus two this side only minus two this is a normal number line next how to draw the number line in rational numbers rational numbers okay now i give an example two by three draw the number line of two by three how to draw the number line just draw one line all the positive rational numbers center part is zero this side negative this side positive all the positive rational numbers are lie between zero and one all the positive rational numbers are lie between zero and one all the negative rational numbers are lie between 0 and minus 1. Are you clear? Negative number means 0 and minus 1. Positive number means 0 and plus 1. Are you clear? So, now just, just see this 2 by 3. First we have to see the denominator. What is the denominator? Denominator is 3. So, 0 and 1. In between, you want to split 3. Okay. In line. This line want to split 3 times. No need take 0. Okay. 1, 2. This one is 3. Are you clear ma? 1, 2, 3. Hmm? Now, denominator is 3. Numerator. 1 by 3. 2 by 3. 3 by 3. So, 3 by 3. Numerator and denominator same means answer is 1. So, you get 1. Where is 2 by 3 locate? So, 2 by 3 is lie between 0 and 1. Are you clear? Like that, how to draw uh, mark the minus 2 by 3? Minus negative rational numbers lie between 0 and minus 1. So, so, 0 and minus 1, uh, denominator is 3. So, if we want to split 3 times, so 1, 2, this one is 3. So, how to write? Minus 1 by denominator is 3. Minus 2 divided by 3. Minus 3 divided by 3. You cancel means, here not having minus, so answer is 1. Here having minus, so the answer is minus 1. Are you clear, ma? How to mark the um, positive rational numbers and negative rational numbers. Next we have to move how to um, draw the rational numbers in number line that is mixed or improper. Mixed numbers or mixed fraction or improper fraction. So first 
Proper fraction means no problem as you should draw the line. Mixed, uh, improper fraction means you just convert the improper fraction into mixed fraction. Then only you want to mark a number line. Okay. I, I get uh, 3 by 2. So it is an improper fraction. So just convert this into proper fraction. So that is 3 by 2. 1, 2 is 2. Balance 1. It is whole number. This is denominator. This is numerator. So W, D, N. So just draw how to mark it. 1, 1 by 2. This only the mixed fraction. How to uh, mark the uh, mark 1, 1 by 2 in number line. Just as usual draw one line. Center part is 0. This one, two. Now see the whole number. First mark the whole number. Whole number is one. Okay. After that one fraction number. That is one by two. So the one by two is like one. One by two is like between one and two. Are you clear? There is no whole number. All the rational numbers are in the uh, lie between zero and one. They are given mixed fraction here having whole number. So the whole number after that one fra proper fraction. So whole number is 1. Proper fraction is uh, 1 by 2. So the 1, 1 by 2 is lie between 1 and 2. Okay. Now see the denominator. Denominator is 2. So how many times want to split in the 1 and 2? Two? 2 times. Here 1. This is 2. So how to write? 1 by 2, 2 by 2. 2 by 2 means it is 1 on cancel. So that is 1. Okay. So where is 1? 1 by 2. So 1, 1 by 2 is this point. You want to write not 1, 1 by 2 or what is the question? Question is 3 by 2. It is only the number line. Are you clear? Any doubt? No. Next, writing a decimal number as a rational number. Decimal number as a rational number. How to convert? That is, they are given 3.0. This is a rational number. Sorry, decimal number. How to convert this decimal number into rational number? So how first expand. How to expand? Before that you want to write the place value. Place value in decimal number after means this is 1's place. This is 10th place. So how to write? 3 by 1 plus 0 by 10. This is only the expanded form. So how to add these two? How to add? The denominator is different. So we have to find the LCM. LCM of 1 and 10 is 10. So 3 by 1 into 10 by 10 is equal to 1 into 10, 10, 3 into 10, 30. Are you clear? What is the next number? 0 by 10 into 1 by 1. We get 10 into 1, 10. Any number multiplied with 0. 0 into 1. 0. So what is the two numbers? 30 by 10 plus 0 by 10. So we have to add means denominator same. We have to add means 30 by 10. 0, 0 cancel. So the answer is 3 by 1 is nothing but 3. Are you clear? Next. Next. 